Yo. Hey, world. Hey, 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 hey. Hey, amazing people. Hope you're all guys doing fine and keeping safe. It's a nice, it's another bright morning that the Lord has made. Of course, we have to rejoice and be glad in it. This is the day, this is the day that the Lord has made, that the Lord has made. We should rejoice, we should rejoice and be glad in it, and be glad in it. Oh, this is the day that the Lord has made. We will rejoice and be glad in it. This is the day. This is the day that the Lord has made. Can I get an amen? <laughs> hey, world! How are you guys doing? Hope you're all doing fine and keeping safe. Welcome back again to my channel. This is Lavin Owiti YouTube channel, and I'm coming from Kenya, that is in East Africa, live from Sea County, the land of heroes, the land of intellectuals, doctors, nurses, lawyers, all those beautiful professions are gotten. Here. without forgetting we also get tall dark and handsome men and we deliver countrywide worldwide ladies are not left behind we are also there you know melamine happy with beautiful body you know so it's another bright day guys thank you so much for showing me love on my last moving video it has really go, go, uh, done well guys we almost uh, we got like uh, 16 good subscribers almost 17 guys i don't know now maybe it's 20 subscribers organic ones guys thank you for the love and support welcome to the family feel loved feel appreciated yeah i'm really so grateful guys yes when i checked yesterday we were less than 30 people for us to hit 3k subscribers kindly by the end of this month let's hit 3k subscribers and i'll really really be so um grateful and appreciative guys because of you that is watching liking is the reason why i'm heading there so thank you thank you thank you a million times guys yeah so live from sierra county guys it's when we are waking up it's early in the morning and the weather is so good and i can't wait to share with you an amazing 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 video with you guys because you are family yeah so let me show you what we are up to today and kindly like the video if you haven't subscribe if you haven't so this is how sierra county looks like when you wake up in the morning early in the morning what you hear is just the birds are singing their melodious sound or let me say like can you hear that guys yeah and uh those that are new here feel loved and appreciated lavin is just a village uh, she was a ghetto girl but now a village girl that resides in the village and shows you her life raw and uncut i also do farming and uh yeah my multi-million dollar home here looks so beautiful yeah i really love it love 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 it guys yesterday it rained it was so 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 uh, uh cold it started raining like 2 p.m. and it it was really cold yesterday it was just a resting day for me because i was really tired with the farm thing but you don't get tired because yesterday it was happy sabbath as the seventh day adventists you know what i mean so it was resting day for me and today we are back to factory our settings guys yeah so yeah welcome to my channel my working gears are here this is a spade you can pick with it even fertilizer putting on your farm and this one is for cleanliness this is here for weeding my flowers and this one for slashing yeah your wife material is ready to get into her work so stay tuned and kindly like the video i'll really really appreciate my farm of late as uh, it's rainy season uh, i've been saying that over and over again and now that um you see how my my weeds have really grown so fast we want to make our environment uh clean yeah look at this beautiful bird guys what i've realized trees really do so well where there is shade like this ones we have not really watered them for that much 
but they have really stuck so quick that is one thing that i've learned for those of you that want to plant trees when you put them where there is a bit shade you see my neighbor's fence is giving some sh some shade i know not all they are going to succeed it's just like babies are being born not all will succeed you see that one has dried up but i'm not giving up because uh, out of 10 at least this one these other ones are doing uh, much better yeah mr g is here crying like it wants to to get out but because of eating veggies I have to lock them out in just one that is lay this nyasiaya that has kids and the other one that lays eggs but this one i'm just letting it out because i'm in the compound when i'm not here i don't let them out because these kids they always sometimes get out of the chicken coop but i'll just i just want them to be out because i'm here in the compound i can see whenever i see them and then nyaksumo is here she's laying so i can't let her in when i let her in the other chicks will eat up her eggs guys what do i do like those of you that are farmers good farmer poultry farmers what how do i go about it? chicks that eat egg should i cut the beak with or i just put some candle fire and then i make the beak to be not sharp to be blunt how do i go about it kindly help me out because that is what i'm going to do to nyaksumo she did that last time she didn't lay eggs she came from kisumu when she just laid i don't know two eggs that were not really good they didn't have shell and then when i gave her nyasiaya's uh, four eggs she just eat them she finished to, they 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 started her her no they started sleeping on their eggs the same day with nyaksumo but with nyasiaya but nyasiaya had hatched and the other one did not so when i went to the box i found like nothing was in there so yeah but this time around she's laying beautiful eggs with with shell like beautiful ones and white one giving a uh, arabic vibe you know the the eggs in the in Saudi, they are always white. For us, ours is brown. Even in the US, guys, right? Those are the parts of the world. But for us, ours are always brown. So yeah, guys, let's work mode get activated. It's a bright Sunday. People are being taken out like... But me, I'm here. <laughs> it's part of life. That day will come, we'll also enjoy. For now, let's keep it moving. And farm, um, cleanliness has to be... Work mode has to be uh keep moving yeah
family, it's a bright Sunday, as I've told you. So, I remember when I first came to the village, I could not even hold a jembe that well. I could not weed. Sometimes I used to try weeding, like the maize, and I, my jembe could hit the maize until it uproots itself, all of it, which it, it was... Guys, I'm sitting next to a shade here because the sun is already out. Or I should stand. I think there the lighting is good, yeah? I could uproot everything, but for now, I try. I know I'm not that um, perfect in farming, but I'm trying as much. I don't want just to hinder myself and like be like, I don't know, I can't do it. You know, before you do something, you have to be sure, like... Uh, in your mind, you have to say that, yes, I can do it. The, our former U.S. president used to say, like, uh, yes, you can. And uh, the best marathonian in Kenya, if that is the correct word, uh, Eliud Kipchoge normally say, like, no human is limited. So it's just you to believe in yourself first before people believe in you. And that's what, what I'm doing, yeah? It's a bright Sunday, guys. Your babe, your babe. I want to show you. I was weeding my flowers, so because the sun is too hot and my camera on a tripod, it will like I will think that I'm vlogging. Then it's just shut down. So I've decided just to do and then they show you the final product. Guys that really believed in me from day one, I really appreciate your your love and support is the one that is making me to do and do extra hard. And you, those that believe in me. You make me just keep grinding higher and higher, guys. I can't imagine we are just about to hit 3K subscribers. From a uh, ghetto girl to a village girl. It's so cool. And today, um, let me show you something. Oh, guys, I've decided like to weed in the morning now. Uh, it's 9 a.m. because So that it can the weeds can dry up uh, so quick before it rains. In our place, it normally rains from afternoon. Like yesterday, it started at uh, 2 p.m. So I've decided to start it so early so that uh, these weeds that I've taken out can dry up. And also these ones dry up and then I put them together and burn them. Or guys, how do you go about the weeds that you take from the farm? For me, I always put them together like these ones. And then when they are dried up, I just come and... Um, uh, burn them. That is normally what I do here. Yeah? So my my fruits are looking so good. I don't know which fruit is this. It looks like uh, a penne, the black cotton. No, black fruit, jackfruit, something of the sort. Yeah, they look so good. And even my my nyaksuma has found a place now to look for those worms and eat. Yeah. This is the work that your girl is doing in a bright Sunday, a beautiful a Sunday it is, yeah? <sighs> so I always put like a hole, big hole like this, and then I put, uh, I leave like a space around it. So when it rains, the water, uh, it holds water for the longest time compared to when I just put it like a hill and then no other space at um around it that is normally what i do and that is how i think it should be done yeah so this is my lemon guys you remember wesley is the one that planted it yeah it's doing so well so what i'm up to right now i want to put some uh, chicken waste that i got um that i have here i needed to improve with them my uh, vegetables place but uh, i've not yet gotten that time guys because we are still in work mode we are not yet yet done so these are the chicken uh, waste guys that i got so like the mangoes i'll just use my hand guys because chicks are not harmful as such so i'll put them like uh, around the around the uh, the fruit you see the sun will hit it and then after it has heated it but this is a flower there is no need it will just grow on its own so the fruits muso are the most important ones to put 
in like that so the sun will heat it and then uh, when it rains it will like get in the soil uh, so oh well guys am i doing the right thing those pro pro people around am i doing the right thing it's your girl lavino witty here trying to beautify her home guys look at how palm gabi looks so beautiful like when somebody will be getting home it's like welcome you know <laughs> it looks so cute for it to consume a lot of water you know they love a lot of water and then there is another one here Another one here. Wow. Wow. The sun is so hot, but four to five, three to four half hours, it will start like shh. Yeah, uh, I really need to weed a lot of things here. Yeah, that is my life in the village, guys. So we are done with the weeding and everything. I really thank God for that. These are purpose guys. You know popo do so well in this area. A lot of people have them. Uh, I've really tried planting some like just eating from the popo and then I plant but it has not worked for me. Whereby some people just uh, eat and then they throw in the farm and it works so good for them. Mine is different. And uh, I was told popo is best planted just where your farm, where you have prepared well. I think that is the mistake. I just throw the seedlings, but they didn't work. But I have one here that is not doing that bad. Uh, this one. We just bought it uh, from those people that sell trees. Guys, you have seen me several times uh, buying them. So even those ones, I just want to put them around here. Uh, around here at the back here where there is a lot of water water can overflow to them I think that one will be better guys yeah so yeah let's plant them so guys uh, I have my manure here I have to put little so that it can work uh, so quick yeah Sierra County, the land of heroes, uh, raw village content, uh, spreading love, spreading vibes, uh, no hatred, no catching feelings, we are only catching flights. We inspire, we impact, we don't brag about anything because God is the one who giveth lives and is the one who taketh. So we have to be humble before him. Yeah. So I've dug my hole, as you can see, uh, I'll put in some manure first. Mm -hmm. And then, in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Mm. I can't wait for it to grow. I've decided to put it next to these cassavas because it's giving them a uh, shade. So when it rains today, uh, it will stick so quick. At least some hole to let them uh, water, to hold water for the longest time. I just want to put them in a row like here, here, here. You see that? Let me put all of it, no problem. Mm. 
In the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Guys, for how long do popo take before they grow? I think one year they should like now start producing. Or guys, I'm in a hurry. Uh, hurry. <sighs> for how long does popo take? Yeah, I'll let it some space for water consumption. And we are done. We are done. share with you my breakfast I've not taken anything uh, so I want to share with you I, I saw a comment in Volt Effect asking that Lavin do you normally like cook like goat meat uh, do you normally like cook goat meat meat or these other things and my answer is no one I'm a pure vegetarian, guys. I'm a pure vegetarian. And, uh, yes, I eat white meat. That is fish and uh, chicken. But chicken, not every chicken I'll eat. I'm so uh, selective because uh, I've not been eating chicken when... I started eating chicken, like, four to five years ago. But I just love the one that is fried or the one that is crunchy. I, I don't like hard one. I don't know, guys. I'm so juicy, and that is really giving me hard time. Yeah, and uh, fish is what I eat that well. Only fish. Yeah, and that is all, also my favorite food, fish. Yeah. So maybe when the boys are here, is when I can I can cook meat or anything. Like, but for now that I'm alone here, it's so hard for me to cook. I'll cook who will eat it. Or maybe nyaseje, but, but just the bones, yeah? The bones for the soup. And then the smell also, I really don't love the smell. Because it makes me, uh, it makes my, me have some, some breakouts. My face really becomes so rough. Uh, when we cook meat, it used to happen to me when I was in uh, my mom's home. So, I'm a pure vegetarian. So what I show you is what I eat. Yeah. What I show you is what I eat most. But I love burgers. I love burger. I don't mind, mind eating burger. But well cooked and well prepared. Yeah, that is. Yeah. So guys, uh, with me here, I have like garlic. I put in some onions, as, as you can see. Those are onions that are in. So I'll put some little oil, cooking oil, for it to cook. For the onions, onions to cook. And then with me here, I have garlic. I'll just put like... Uh, Two is enough. Yeah. Hey, 
guys, this space is so good. I'm loving it, this veranda. Like, I'm loving it, guys. The sun is so hot out whereby I remember sometimes life is a journey, guys. Just believe in yourself. It's a process. Like, I never thought that one day I'll have a veranda like this. I know it's someone might say no this just iron sheet how this girl is bragging or she's trying to tell us like is it her first time seeing it yeah it's not my first time i've not seen it but i'm um, now i have it having something of your own feels so good compared to like i can now start bragging like it's my mom so if it's my mom it's my mom it's not mine right so I'm so happy. Guys, the sun is so hot in here. The, the, the surprisingly, in Sierra County, it will rain today. The following day, around now, now it's 11, 30, 12 noon, the sun is so hot, whereby you, you just want to walk like ch chestless. And being a woman, you can't walk chestless. But when I'm in the house, I can walk. Those are those weird things that you do when you are alone, yeah? So, it has really helped me, like, oh. Imagine now I'm cooking here. My phone is just here. And, uh, yeah, I'm cooking. No sun, no anything. The heat is just cool. And and now that I'm using Jiko, Jiko is always so hot. You can't cook with it in the house or because of the carbon monoxide yeah so oh, our onions our um, onions are almost cooked guys what am i going to add next i'm going to add my garlic because garlic always tastes so good when you put with your food and then i'll add in my uh ginger this is also good because of the people that always have like tonsils. It's so good. Cough. And for ladies, you know the work of gingers, right? You know it? I don't want to mention. And we have some uh, green pepper here. I just use a little. I know some of you maybe don't know local Jiko. Local Jiko, this one called use charcoal with it. It's good for charcoal. what do you guys do like when you are bored for those that are seventh day adventists we, we fellowship on saturday right so on a sunday when you are just at home what do you do are you just bored like for me every sunday now it will like be cleaning uh, my flowers also like weeding um the trees that is what i'll be doing every sunday sometimes when the time is right guys but for now, I don't want to think about everything. Until the day I'll be done with my farm. Uh, even the woman has come just right now. And I was telling her, why did you not come yesterday? But I understand because yesterday it rained so early. So she couldn't make to come. Yeah? Uh. Wow, wow. Yeah, I saw a video I did about, I don't know whether the camera is doing justice. Mm -hmm. Yeah, let me leave it there. So, guys, I saw a video yesterday. This is how it looks like. I saw, yesterday I did a video. Um, uh, when I was sick, no, not yesterday, when Regan was here, right? I did a video 
uh, when I was sitting down. And uh, I had a click. I thought that my oh, I thought that my phone has shut. So I did a video sitting down, and her sister was really, really concerned. Like, Lavin, stop sitting down. You will get arthritis. Guys, I'm so used to sitting on the floor. I don't know why. Because of Middle East, we used to sit on the floor. You can have a chair, a beautiful couch here, but you just decide to sit down. Yeah. Thank you for your concern, and that's why today I've decided to to have this African mat, which is not that cold compared to sitting on the ground like that. Oh, this one is spoiled. This is even one with dinner. Life in the countryside, village life, yeah? And then, to make it spice up uh, that well, some red pepper. If you cook with red pepper, it always tastes so good, guys, honestly. Yeah. Ooh, this one is out of this world. And then this Royco, it's just a, a Kenya. It's a Kenyan one. Yeah, I've not seen this brand outside the country. Apart from Kenya, then a pinch of salt. See that, guys? See that? So we want to make some tea here. This, are, this is the rosemary and uh, lemongrass. Add water. For it to boil, boil. ready. I wish you could feel the aroma. And get it boiled already. Have to sieve it. Then it looks well cooked. And then you turn back like that. Okay. You wash your fruit that you're going to have. You're going to have orange.
Exactly that. And then... No, breakfast is ready. No, it's breakfast stroke lunch because that it's already 12. It's already 12 noon. And uh, yeah, this one, the best thing about this meal is that you can take it now and you still be full until night. You can have two meals per day when you have this. Some have three, some are so rich. Like breakfast, bread and, and lunch time and supper. The taste is out of this world. Ginger, pepper, garlic, onions, tomatoes. Guys, you know what I mean? Yeah. So thank you so much, guys, for watching this video and spending time with me. Even the woman that was supposed to help me, today she has come so early. Um, I just want to see how she's working and then we see how we'll end our video for now. Kindly give the video a like. Tell me the kind of videos that you want to see now, and I'll be sure to do them. Live from Sierra County, the land of intellectuals, the land of lawyers, yeah. That is where Lavin is. Family, guess what? Do you know I went back to the farm after having my lunch? I went back to the farm. I was forced, because when I see someone working, <laughs> Of late, I don't know what is happening. When I see someone working, I just want to like help them out. So I was in the farm. At least I've done something. And even the woman is really doing uh, much. Yeah, and we have a kid here who is trying to... I don't want to shoot her, but that is her, that is her, that is her. That is her, guys. <laughs> yeah, she's trying to arrange this for me. That is what her mom told her. Let no one say that it's child level. She's just just some small pieces in the farm these are the trees that we cut down um, the other day when we were building our chicken coop here guys you remember when we were building our chicken coop here so the 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 branches were left and these are so good when they dry up we are going to like have firewood to cook you see we're going to have firewood to cook with and then these ones the leaves really light up so quick they're like uh, they're like paraffin. Let me say that. Oh, I've said paraffin until... Guys, paraffin... It's, I used paraffin so long time ago. Like nowadays people don't use paraffin that so much in Kenya, Africa. People use solar. Solar is just in lead. Because long ago we used to use these uh, small chimneys. Is chimney the right word? We call it in my native language, Nyangile. Or in Swahili we call them Koroboi. English, they are like lamps, but they use like kitambi, and then you put paraffin. It's just like um, a tin, a steel tin. Then it lights up the house. When you wake up in the morning, when you do your nose like this, it's all black. Oh, guys, people have come from far. We have really come from far. Your nose will have those smokes in the morning when you go to school. But now the world has changed. Uh, people are really ha solar is in lead. I know electricity is not that much, but solar is really really helping us More so me now that I'm in the village. That is what I use to charge my phone with Yeah So thank you for the solar companies that thought of us. Yeah, so Guys we are almost getting there. I can't wait for us to get in at the front of the gate like um she started from here, but the bad part about when it rains, the bad part about when it rains, when you weed and then it rains, uh -huh. the weeds tend to grow so fast. You see that? The weeds tend to grow so fast. But Regan did a great job. You see, it's almost two weeks, but the weeds are not yet. 
so much compared to now that we are we are weeding now in the very very time the nimbus clouds are here uh god wants to shower us with his blessings yeah so it's not that much part remaining oh guys this farm has really given us headache like let me say for me yeah it's not that big part this is the place where that tipper the car was stepping on when it was going the other side you see it, it made a road like yeah so the hardest part here is just this front part here because she has already hold this other side so she'll just go like 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 but the maize are really they really dried up they didn't come out so nicely like last time see the, this one nothing came out yeah I had started here. I had started we did here. But I felt so tired and left everything. In the back of that tree. Guys, I know we have shared a lot. Uh, I don't want these rains to get me when I've not yet put my things in. As today I showed you I was working, working, working. It's so tiresome but it's worth it. So let's take out our chicks, put in the sacks that our chickens sleep on, just organize everything and then take shower before it rains. Because when it rains, it's always so cold. You can't even go out like to take shower again because you will be sneezing all the night, you know. So let's take shower before... Uh, God pours his blessing upon us. Yeah. Woo! Family, loves, moms, dads, babies, the beloved, most favored, Woo! winners. Thank you for your love and support. Um, I really, really appreciate everything. An owl wants to take my neighbor's cheeks. <laughs> That's why people are shouting. That is how we normally do. Like, sha, sha, and you shout your voice. Ah! You know, so that they all can know that you are around, you know. So, thank you guys for staying with me. Thank you for liking my videos. Thank you for watching my videos. Your love is really... Don't look at my armpit. Your love is really, really appreciated, guys. Of course, you are God's favorite child. Let no one tell you otherwise. Until next time, adios. Bye-bye. I love you all and uh, stay blessed. Let the blessed say that you are blessed. Yeah. Bye. It's raining, guys. I predicted it. Just immediately after coming from the farm. Guys, I told you that it was going to rain. It's 5.50. Oh, let's see those things that we planted today. <laughs> you see what I always tell you? When you do like this, it, cons it like preserves some water. You go do a good hole. It's just that the chicken has done that thing. It comes and just wants to eat that space. Oh my God, it's so cold. <sighs> All this beauty and rain is all found from Sierra County, the land of intellectuals. No other place, guys. Yeah. Ooh. It's not even yet 6 p.m. I managed to harvest this, all of this. Yes, all of this. I know my tank now, it's like it wants to overflow. Naksumu and Nyasiaya, get in the house so cold if I could not have taken out my utensils so quick it could have rained on me but I'm so sad because now this farm thing is really taking the longest time because she just came after two hours the rains are there the last time she came 
she came so late rains came so i don't know god knows better so yeah guys bye bye see you i had finished the video but uh i just wanted to show you after the rain